Yo guys, welcome back to a brand new PDCGO Battle Styles video. Today, guys, we're taking a look at a single strike mustard deck. Now, with Battle Styles, we got two new cards called Mustards. They're single strike and rapid strike mustard. They're very similar to Archie's Ace in the Hole, where you can play this card if it is the last card in your hand, and if it is, you can search your deck for a single strike Pokemon and put it on your bench, and then you can draw five cards. So you get a nice new hand of five, and you get to put a Pokemon in play for free, which is really powerful. Um, now, unfortunately, there's not many good targets right now because we don't have that many single strike and rapid strike Pokemon. There's going to be a lot more coming out in the next couple sets, so this card will most likely get a lot stronger as time goes on. For the time being, though, it's not the greatest card ever, but we're going to try to make it work today in standard using cards like Embor and Houndoom as our targets for single strike mustard. Now, before we get in the video, I do want to give a quick shout out to Pokemon TPCI for hooking me up with a chilling rain booster box. I am going to be opening this up on Friday on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash Fury. link down below. Um, they hooked me up with a, with a Chilling Rain Booster Box. When you open up on Twitch, most likely um, in the afternoon, Eastern Standard Time. Um, or it's potentially in the evening. I haven't decided yet. Make sure you follow my Twitch down below uh, so you can get notifications when I go live with the pack opening. But I am going to open up the box. And I'm excited, man. There's a lot of exciting cards in the set. There are even more Single Strike and Rapid Strike cards in the set. So Mustard is going to get a bit better. So yeah, before the video, guys, of course, shout out to the sponsor, Card Cabin TCG. As always, guys, if you're ever looking for any PCGO pan codes, get them over at Card Cabin. Card Cabin is selling codes online for the cheapest. So if you guys want to pick up any set codes like Battle Styles, Shiny Fates, Vivid Voltage, Storm Shield Base Set, any of the Sun and Moon sets, maybe some X and Y sets, or if you're maybe looking for any potential V or GX promo codes or pre-release kit codes, sleeve codes, a battle kit code, theme deck code, get them over at Card Cabin. If you get any codes over at Card Cabin Course, guys, at the checkout, you can use my discount code, code LDF, for a 5% discount on your purchase at the checkout. Help the channel, help yourself out, and help out Card Cabin. So, big shout out Card Cabin. Check them out. Use code LDF if you get any codes over there. Um, Yeah, also check out the video articles I've been posting, too, if you want to go give them a watch. Anyways, let's look at the list here. So, this is what I'm rocking with for my Single Strike Mustard deck. Now, again, Mustard's not the greatest right now. Both Rapid Strike and Single Strike Mustard don't really have the best targets because we just don't have that many single strike or rapid strike pokemon that are really worth putting into play for free we're still gonna make this card work i actually think after looking at it i think single strike mustard might be better than rapid strike right now because you actually have decent targets the big one i think is going to be houndoom allowing you to put a free houndoom in play very good houndoom really does carry these single strike decks right now because of its single strike roar ability allowing you to put energy on uh, which is just really good and i'm also using embor as another target uh fighting fury stance could be kind of cool uh, plus, I think Embor is put in the thumbnail, so, you know, I gotta... Hopefully, we can put it in play at one point. But having that extra 30 damage boost could actually make a big difference. Um, thankfully, we do have some pretty good attackers to choose from. We got Single Strike Tyrantar. We got Single Strike Urshfu. And of course, we got Single Strike Urshfu V Max. And then we got Donjurner V as our targets. Uh, maybe we could play another uh, Single Strike V Max here. But those are our targets um, for the Busted Mustard um, for the partners. And usually it's just Mustard to Houndoom in play. Now, there is a huge issue with Single Strike Mustard, and that is we have to have it as the last card in our hand, which is not the easiest thing to pull off, especially in Standard. And in Expanded, it's not that hard with Archies, but in Standard, it's a little tough. So I'm going to be playing Galarian and Meowth, which allows you to discard two cards from your hand, um, which basically can help us get to Mustard. And then we also have cards like Quick Ball and Viridian Forest, just to try to put our hand down to a low hand i'm even playing an electromagnetic radar to try to even push it a little bit further there is one issue i have with meowth though is i don't really like having meowth in play um that's why i don't really play like that many like extra basics i'm playing one to den and a meowth but i don't like having too many basics in the deck because it clogs over a bench because we're because if our draw supporter has to be like mustard and we don't have room on our bench then uh it's a little a little sus <laughs> you know it's a little sus so it's like we kind of have to be a little careful with what we bench um but I am, you know, using Meowth and Dedenne to get there. Got some rods in the deck in case we discard Pokemon. Uh, a Pelpad wouldn't be bad either because you might end up discarding supporter cards trying to go Mustard. So a Pelpad might not be terrible, but there's only so much cards I can put in this deck. Uh, like there's only so much, you know, so much room in the deck, you know. Uh, Urn of Vitality is really good. It's pretty simple stuff you'll see in most, you know, most uh, single strike decks. Capture energy, fine energy, or single strike energy. Pretty straightforward stuff. Um, yeah, that's the list. We tried out and... Uh, Let's see how many times we can use Mustard and uh, try it out. Again into our first match with Single Strike Mustard. We'll see how this deck ends up playing. See if we can pull off some cool little Mustard plays. All right. Now with this hand, we do not have Mustard in our hand. Um, Not a bad hand, to be honest. Hmm. 
I don't know what we're playing against. Looks like it might be ADP, unfortunately. Good old ADP. Most cringe deck ever. We can grab... Ooh, we probably have a lot of attackers. Yikes. Well, we can always muster to nurture food B max into play. So it's actually not that bad. We have Rod, I guess. I don't know what to grab. I mean, we could grab the Dene for next turn. And then, like, Capture G. I, I want to play Capture G on an attacker. I think we just get Urshifu and just put a Capture G on it. I don't know. We're going to be in top deck mode, though. I don't know how I feel about this. We could get Marnie, though. You know, we could get Marnied. We could also just draw Mustard here. If we draw Mustard, we can just go for the uh, Mustard play. Yeah, that seems fine. I don't know. See what happens. Honestly, I wouldn't mind. Um, I don't know. We'll see. We could also just get Marnied. Oh, what the? We're playing against Fling. Hmm. Not gonna lie, I'm not sure how this how this matchup plays. Well, don't from the Jirachi. I actually don't know if they're playing a full-on Phalanx deck. Okay, there's a Marnie. That's fine because we do well, we actually could just knock them out with Hound Doom if we really had to, but this is fine. We could get the mustard off with this Marnie here. We do not. We don't draw. We would have had the mustard, but we didn't draw into a mustard. Where's my mustard at, bro? Quick ball. Yeah, okay. This is a, I don't think this is a normal Phalanx deck. They're playing a lot of... I don't know. Jirachi. Hmm. Yeah, it's not normal Phalanx. It ain't the normal Phalanx. I think they're... I think they're using like a B deck. I don't know. Let's just... Hmm. Impact low should be good enough. But I might want to use... Um, rapid. I might use Single Strike Urshfu. Our range is not really good. I think it's just going to be... Single Strike Urshfu is going to do a lot of the work here. Yeah, hope we can draw a mustard here. We could to Dene and try to go mustard. I might have to do that, in all honesty. Ooh, they're digging. But they've they already played a supporter, so they can't do B this turn. Yeah, they have the Phalanx, Guru. So they're right now, they're taking 20 less, 40 less damage. They have 200 HP. So we can still knock them out with impact blow. I don't think they play cape or anything. Do they have room for cape? They can always B it away. Hope we can get a supporter here. Like a Marnie or a mustard would be good. Oh, I don't need that many Pokecoms game. I appreciate it, but I do not need three freaking Pokecoms in my hand. There's the mustard. The boys are in the deck. The boys are... I think we have the Dedene. I really don't want to do Dedene, but... This game's like, nah, bro. Let's just... Here, take, take a bad hand. Like, Alright, cool beans, fam. Thank you for the bad hand. Well, I don't really want to knock out this Jirachi with Urshifu right now anyways, but let's just Dedene. We are losing a lot of Pokemon comms, which sucks, man. Okay. Got the mustard. We got the mustard here, but at what cost? Gotta calculate this real quick. So let's put that on. Quick ball away. This. I don't want to put the Viridian in play. We can grab... I actually don't really want to grab a basic. I might keep that mustard spot open. What am I even mustarding for? Tempted to grab Urshifu, but I'm also tempted to just get another Houndoom in play. Uh, we could grab Embor too. That's not terrible. Having Embor in play wouldn't be bad, I guess. Embor is not terrible. Actually, if we had Embor in play and we had a single strike, we actually could have just KO'd this Jirachi with Bite. That would have been kind of funny. I, I am tempted to just grab Embor here, not going to lie. I don't know. We can fail the Quick Ball because we can always pull off another Muster the next turn. Oh no, we have to grab Pokemon. Never mind. We have to grab Pokemon. Um, I was grab Meow. I guess then I have to give him Viridian. We can have Meow. I don't want to give him a Viridian Force though, so let's just E Radar. I don't want to give them Viridian. Yeah, I don't want to give him Viridian. All right, we're gonna mustard. All right, so we got Houndoom, Embor, or Rat, or Single Strike V Max. Those are the my those are my possible targets. Which one would be the best? Houndoom probably would be the best. We can't kill the Jirachi, though. We can knock him out with Impact Blow Forceman to try to get a B knockout this turn. Don't mind that. We could also just grab Embor, and then we have that extra firepower. Or we can grab the VMAX, and we have two different Urshifus in play that can both threaten my opponent. Honestly... I think it's Embor, bro. I'm going Embor here. You know what's in the thumbnail? I'm grabbing Embor. Ooh. Not like this, bro. What is his hand? 
Okay, well, I was expecting to maybe get another Houndoom off of that, but, uh, no such luck. <laughs> well, ah, uh, crap. Oh, it's not good. I'm gonna pass. I'm not gonna bench anything. Well, yeah, I could have benched on Journer, I guess. Probably should have, to be honest. That sucks. That was a pretty bad, uh, that was a pretty bad mustard. I mean, I, well, they could Marnie me, right? I mean, they're, they're playing a B deck, but they still might Marnie me. We'll see. Maybe I should have gone Houndoom. Which we don't need it right now anyways. Because as long as they don't boss me. But they're not going to. If they go B, they can't boss. Let's see if they find a B this turn. Yeah, that was that was not the greatest Mustard. I was hoping the Mustard would get us into another Mustard for next turn. That's why I didn't want to bench anything. Because we can like do a double Mustard and like grab like another Houndoom. Or grab the Rapid Strike VMAX. Or Single Strike VMAX. Whatever. Whatever Urshifu Bear it is. But uh, yeah, this Mustard kind of gave us nothing to work with. Could still draw a Mustard though. We can't play it, but... Yeah, not, that was not a good mustard at all. My boy mustard didn't work out. Let's see. I might play aggressive and knock out the Drachi, though. That's why maybe we should have been Stonjuner. But we can't go into it unless we draw an air balloon. If we draw air balloon, we can go into the Stonjuner here. Potentially in Lance Pulse, which I would like to do. Oh, they're going to boss my Embor. No, bro, this man's stuck. Oh, crud. Now our Embor is stuck in the active. We actually can't move it. Yeah, we don't play Bird Keeper. Oh, no. Bro, the big brain play, bro. Now I regret getting Embor. I think it was still fine to grab the Embor, though, but I did not expect them to boss it. Like, my thought process was not my opponent's going to boss my Embor and trap it in the active spot for a turn. We can attack with it, I guess. And that takes a long time, though, especially because we don't have another Houndoom. That's kind of out of the picture. We already we have plus we have two singles in our hand. It's not even worth it to power this thing up. I'm just gonna keep passing. I'm not even gonna bother. There's no no nowhere to put energy. Like, I don't know. I guess we could draw. We could draw like an urn, I guess. We could have attached and then went Houndoom on the Embor and then draw an urn, in away a single, earn it back. But we don't have another Houndoom. I don't think it works out. I don't know. We could I guess we could have attacked in two turns, but I again I didn't expect them to bring up my Embor. I like I just didn't I didn't see that coming. I thought they were going to be, but they bossed my Embor, which I didn't expect. Which kind of sucks now, because we are losing a little bit of our damage output. But I think we can still kill the B the Phalanx if they get a cape on. This is also why I like having the Embor in play, because it gives us that extra damage to work with. Okay, they're going to rope. No cap. I'm really tempted just to give them the Den Age. I'm, I'm on, like, bro, I kind of want to keep my Hound Hour in play. I am very tempted just to give them a Dedenne here. I think, no, it has to be Hound Hour, right? Yeah, it's got to be Hound Hour. Dang it, bro. I don't know. Like, if we draw a Houndoom, we have Capture Energy, though. It's not that bad. I don't know. We can... I was going to give him the Dene, but it's like, I don't want to give him any more prizes. But we get, we get to keep our pig alive, so. <laughs> That's good. I mean, I'll probably just bench Tyranitar. We might have to do Single Strike Crush at this rate, because we did prize a lot of Urshis. We can't seem to also get another big boy in play. I think another Mustard. Yeah, we're going to have to power up Titar here, unfortunately. I mean, it's not the worst attacker ever, I guess. I don't really want to discard the top four cards in my tech, bro. But it's going to have to happen. Impact blow. All right. Hopefully we can live it. Well, the nice thing is actually um, they need to find another B and switching card. Okay, there's... there. We, okay, perfect cards. Urn and Vitality. Urn and Urshfu. Sorry. Those are really good prizes. We keep Membor alive, so that's good. I mean, we could go... I don't know. Actually, what could happen here if, like, they don't get... If they don't do anything this turn, they don't knock me out. Like, they don't get a B off or something. We actually could go for a Kregelanch knockout on Jirachi, which I would probably prefer to do. And we can mill the top two cards of their deck. I don't... We're not going to be able to deck them out. I mean, B discards cards, and then we have Tyranitar on top of that. I don't think that matters, though. Okay, let's see. Do they have a B? They have a three-card hand. Will they find a B here? If they don't get a B, I am going to probably retreat here. Oh, quick ball. They're bench locked. So they have their one card in their hand either has to be a B or they have to have a scoop up net. Or Poke Gear. If they don't have a B, we're going to probably go Craig and Lynch, knock out Jirachi so I can save Urshifu for the Phalanx. I kind of like that. They could play Karate Belt. What if they Wisdom into a B, bro? Imagine that. The world's greatest primate wisdom. Uh, oh, oh, they don't have it. Oh, Houndoom, beautiful. Okay, we actually have a lot of different things we can do here. Um, we can't attack. 
We definitely... We can knock him out Tyranitar. We have to discard the top four cards of our deck. But we're, like, very much set up to win, so I think that's fine. Please retreat. Go. Attach. Quick ball. Then out the deck. Play the urn. We need to find more, more cards, though, so that's that, but... We go single strike roar. Ooh, the man. We'll save the other single strike roar for a rainy day. And then we'll just go. Ooh, actually, no, you know what? I might just do single strike roar now, just because my opponent might we might lose our other single strike energy off of that. We're doing a ton of damage though. We could just win in two attacks. So let's just go single strike crush and pray we don't discard half of our deck. That's like important. Oh my gosh. I think I saw two urn of vitalities. There we go. That's what I was worried about. That's fine though. As long as this guy can clean up the game, we shouldn't, we should be fine. This is why I put the single strike energy on, because we just lost two more of our urn of vitalities. We didn't lose any supporters, though, which is good. What do we end up losing? Urn, rod. Okay, not the ideals, but you know what? I'll take it. As long as we have this last search, we just, I mean, we are one boss away from winning, too. Because we can knock out to Denier Crobat, too. Don't forget. Okay, there's a B, finally. Ooh, they only get two energy. They might not have one here. This is why I didn't want to give them a Viridian Forest. They're down 9, 11 energy. We'll see if they have one. If they do have one, I think we have an energy in the deck. Okay, they have a Dedenne still, so they can still dig. Let's see. They're definitely going to get energy. There's no way they're going to whiff it. They play like 14, yeah. So Tyranitar is going to go down here. And I th think we win the game. We just need to... If we have an energy in the deck, we win. Embor is going to let us do more damage. I mean, it, we, we already knock him out with Impact Blow, but as long as we have an energy in the deck, which we're guaranteed, right? I think we have a basic energy in the deck. I mean, I hope so. If not, we're in trouble. Hey, Mustard, how you doing? Let's just check the deck real quick. Yep, we got one in the deck. The last one. This is why I held the Viridian. You never know, my opponent could have countered the Stadium, too. Let's go. The very last thing... And Impact Blow. It's going to do a lot of damage thanks to Energy and Embor. Boom, there we go. Whew, that was a match. That was an interesting game. Yeah, that was a very interesting game. That was weird. <laughs> but you know what? I'm glad we mustered Embor in play. I was hoping we would use some Embor in this video. And uh, yeah, we, we mustered Embor in a play. And it actually wasn't that bad. That 30 damage kind of helps us, you know? Made things interesting. We only did one mustard that game. I mean, we after that first mustard, we just weren't unable to kind of even find a supporter, but we kind of made things work from there. Maybe we should put like a pal pad in the deck. Maybe we should play like a pal pad. All right, we got what two chests open up here. Maybe we can pull something good. Ooh, reverse pal sand. I'll take it. You know, maybe if I want to do another pal sand mill video, there we go. Uh, tool scrapper. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'll take it. Anyways, let's get another match with the mustard. All right, here we go, getting into our next match here with Busted Mustard. The Mustard, man. Mustard is what I call it. Single Strike Mustard. All right, let's see if we can pull off some Mustards today in this next game. And, oh, uh, we're close. We are close, but no cigar. We need to draw... Well, we could go Berserker, I guess. Maybe we do have it. Okay. All right, I was scared we were playing against Decidueye, which... I mean, we can beat... We have Embor, Houndoom, Stonjourner, and, M like... Like, yeah, those are all good attackers, but I don't think it is. All right, there's a Dedenne. Oh, it's an ADP deck. Okay, they're clickbaiting. Oh, they got Crushing Hammer, though. That's annoying. That's so rude, bro. Well, we'll see if they pull off any shenanigans with Alter Creation. Yep, there's a Quick Ball. It's going to get the uh, ADP. Fun times. Yeah, I think we're going to have to muster this turn, honestly. It's going to have to be the Urshfu show today. Yeah, and they oh, why did he find the water, bro, every time? Oh, my God. Oh, there's Hound. Okay, now we get mobile. Okay, this is actually really good. That was maybe the best top deck we could have gotten. Because now we get mobile basics in play. We still don't have... Oh, no, we can't get mobile basics. Never mind. Okay, well, here's what we'll do. We have to get Meow. Yeah, okay, we're one card off. We actually, we could have discarded the energy, I guess. We could have gotten the Hound. Eh, whatever. Not a big deal. Quick ball for... We need a card that we don't want to use in this matchup. Probably Tyranitar, to be honest. No, Stonjourner is actually even... Well, actually, Lance Pulse could be good against Crobat and Dedenne. Hmm. There's, like, no good card I want to discard. We have to choose something, though. I think it's Tyranitar. I think it's, like, the most useless card in the matchup. I don't know. 
a stun generator could be useful, like KO Crobat or something with Lance Pulse. All right, we have to muster a Houndoom in play. Today, there we go. Ah! There we go. Okay, okay, chill, chill out. Quit spamming the hellos. Nah, I'll unmute you. Oh. Here we go. Single strike roar. They are playing Crushing Hammer, which is annoying. We did just lose an urn. Our hand's not very good to follow up with either. Oh, we can draw another mustard. We can put another Houndoom in play. We'll have to see what happens. Just laser focus. Put one energy in play. We don't need to... I know, I know they play Crushing Hammer. We don't need to put too many energy in play. Next turn, we can actually kill the ADP. So we'll see. Mustard into the Houndoom and hopefully go from there. I just wish Mustard gave me a better hand, like AKA giving me another Mustard. But we can take him out though, because we have Evil Wind Sense and Capture. As long as they don't get a Crushing Hammer, like, I think they would need double heads to stop me here. Maybe. We'll see. I want to get another Mustard off though, if I can, to be honest. I want a Mustard and get another, uh, probably a third Houndoom, to be honest. Probably just need three Houndooms. All right. Um. All right, nice. Alteration, and we're going to kill their little ADP. <sighs> that is not what I'm looking for. <laughs> well, anyways. Evil Wind Sense for the Urshifu VMAX. Good thing is we can't get knocked out by Zacian next turn. Because we did have to Hound him again. We'll capture energy. Probably just fail it. Yeah. I'm just going to take a knockout. Yeah. I'm not going to do anything else. I'm just going to take a KO. I'm not going to bench Urshifu because it could have like a boss play or something. I doubt it, but it's possible. Still need to get more stuff, but we are finally going to get a bit of a prize lead. Hopefully we can find some supporters or something. Uh, there's a Dedene. Scroll's pretty good. So if they just Brave Blade me here, we can just knock him out with Scroll, which is nice. And we don't have to do another G-Max one blow. But are we just going to beat ADP, bro? One time, bro? Is it the is it the Mustard into the Houndoom to beat the... Yes, let's go! All right, let's go. We took down ADP because we Mustard a Houndoom in play. We're getting some pretty weak sauce hands off these musters, though. That's two musters we've played, and our hands have not been the greatest. Hopefully, we can get some better hands next time. I get into another match with mustard. Probably one last game. We do win the coin flip. I will go first. Going second with mustard doesn't really do much. Uh, there's Meowth, but we got no mustard. We can get mustard. We have it for next turn. Let's we'll see what we're playing against. Can't tell. Okay, quick ball's good. Quick ball way boss for Hound Hour. Yeah. Or just pass. Next turn, we do have a mustard if we can draw one, but I don't know if we will. So if not, I'm probably just going to go Marnie. Just go from there, I guess. Yeah, no mustard in her hand. Kind of stings. Definitely wanted to see my boy mustard so we can mustard something into play. Hmm. It looks like they're playing potentially Colossal. That's what I'm guessing. Yeah, it's Colossal. We can be Colossal. It's winnable. But we need to get mustard. One below actually isn't very good in this matchup because we can't really one-shot... Oh, maybe we could use Embor, actually. Hmm, maybe Embor actually lets Urshifu VMAX one-shot a Colossal with one blow. That's actually maybe something we can look to doing. Which we're unable to get going, because currently we, can, we can't see a Mustard right now. Um, which is lovely, but we'll see what happens. A Mustard top deck would be great. Okay, Marnie, that's good. We can Marnie, they can Marnie me into a Mustard, right? Marnie four cards with a Meowth should be a pretty easy time to Mustard, right? Piece of cake. Oh, if we draw a Pokemon, even better. We can get a Pokemon down. All right, let's go, Marnie. Thank you for helping me out and giving me a Mustard. I appreciate that. Appreciate that time. You, Marnie, usually you're a terrible card, but you're good today. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. We have to play an extra energy on, but that's fine. We can go do this. We can check the deck. We have Urshfu, right? Yeah, yeah, we got both. We have Embor, yeah. We'll earn... Put the energy on Hound Dower, and then we will Mustard. But what are we going to put into place? The question. Probably just a Houndoom, right? I was thinking about Embor, but I think we'll just get a Houndoom. We're kind of far behind on the Houndoom. Well, there won't be an Embor in play next turn. We'll get Single Strike Stun Junior going, though. We'll do one Single Strike Roar. Power up this guy while we're at it. We're going to have one Mustard left. It doesn't look like we're going to get Embor in play, guys. Unless we uh, draw a Pokecom. Not looking likely. Oh, they got hammers. I forgot about that card. Damn it. Lucky heads. Hmm. So they could boss my guy this turn. They could knock out Houndoom. That would be really annoying. If they actually pull off a boss here, I'm gonna be pretty I'm gonna be pretty annoyed. 
possible. I mean, my opponent did have some crushing hammer, so clearly they got the luck on their side, right? Right? Yeah, really? I mean, I maybe we should play a pal pad in the deck. Because we have pal pad here. We could just put back the mustard with pal pad. Maybe we wish I had a pal pad. Uh, best case scenario, they don't get a prize this turn. Nope, never mind. I We can set this up to be KO'd, though. As long as I don't play Cheryl or Maulana, we can set up to be KO'd by Urshifu. Oh, they're going to murder me. There goes our mustard. So it's unlikely we're going to pull off a mustard here. But that's fine because we keep our Embor. And again, that might be kind of useful. Maybe. We get to keep two mustards. So we have one more for later. Nice. Pretty good hand. We can get another Houndoom in play. We can hit them with Lance Pulse and go from there. Huh. That was in, they air balloon the Colossal, but they don't attack. I guess they didn't have the attack, obviously. That's an interesting play. I guess they didn't have anything. They do play Hammer. It's a little annoying, so I'm not going to bother attaching energy this turn. Well, no, I think we do, right? I don't know. Let's just research. Air balloon one time. Little double energy. I guess now would be a good time just to go single strike roar because we have Vern in our hand, so. Build up Urshifu. Pass. No Mustard for next turn. But Meowth's probably a goner anyways. But I do still want to use my boy Mustard if we can. We'll see if we get to use it, though. We'll see what ends up happening here. They could have a boss in their hand. They could kill Houndoom. That's why I mentioned Houndour, obviously. Then we keep Meowth by Then we can always set up for another Mustard later on. No, they're going to murder me again. All right, that's fine. Losing the urn sucks because I got a bad feeling they're going to find a crushing hammer, but we'll see. Mustard? Ah, oh, no mustard. No mustard. We got calm. Actually, a pretty bad Marnie, to be honest. Maybe a Dene. What are they digging for? Ooh, they're down five supporters now. Oh, Wonder's Labyrinth. That's annoying. Nice. There we go. There we go. The Wonders Lab is definitely a problem, though, for sure. But we have two Viridians still in the deck. I think they're in the deck. I mean, hopefully, if they're in the, not in the deck, we could lose. Maybe. Are we going to get knocked out finally? Are they just... Maybe they're waiting to get the first boss on me. That might be what's happening here. That might be why they haven't killed Meowth. We have an Air Balloon, so we can... Dip it here. If we can draw Viridian, we can knock out Crobat with Stonjourner. I like conserving me out. No, they're going to go for the KO. Do they have a uh, eruption shot? They do. Okay. We can swing with impact blow. They're going to G-Max fall me. Then we can finish them off with Hunter. They have a lot of resources left, so anything is possible. Maybe top deck here. Perfect. But we can E-Radar for Dedene. But I kind of want to keep single strike scroll of scorn. I might wait a turn. Right. Yeah, I'll wait a turn. I'll wait a turn to E radar. Well, does it ever matter? I don't maybe it doesn't. If yeah, we're no there's no I think we have to soften them up with Stonjourner first. I'm gonna go here. Play scroll now, I guess. It's gonna land pulse. And then we'll KO them next turn with Urshfu. They could have a boss. They probably do have a boss, but we'll see. That's why I didn't really want to commit too much energy to the Urshfu, because if they just have a boss, then it's rip. We'll see what they do. Too bad we can't two-shot them with the Stone Journer, but they have 250 HP, so we have to go Urshfu next turn. We have to go Urshi VMAX. No, they play Swell too. They found it, bro. There goes our Viridian. That sucks. Might be harder to get Mustard in play now. Especially because we probably have to lose our e Raider for Dedene. I'm going to have to give him a Dedene. That just sucks, bro. This is an uphill battle for sure. They concede? All right, I'll take it. All right, I think I'm going to wrap today's speech up, guys, with the Mustard deck today with those matches. Um, got a lot of stuff on my plate, so I'm going to end off the video with those Mustard games. Again, Single Strike Mustard will get a lot better. We have some chests to open up, too. But yeah, Single Strike Mustard will get a lot better when more cards come out. There's a lot of new Single and Rapid Strike cards, so... Mustard will get a lot better. If you guys want to see me do a video on Rapid Strike Mustard, let me know down in the comments. I will be down to make a Rapid Strike Mustard deck. So let's open up those chests that we ended up getting and end off today's video. I'm surprised they conceded there, but whatever. Maybe the mustard's too good. Look at that. 25 coins and Reverse All Luxio. All right. What's in this? Reverse Air Balloon's not bad. I mean, I have Secret Rare, but you know, Air Balloon's one of the best uh, cards from Sword Shield base set. Ooh. All right. 10 coins and our rare is... Oh, reverse Snorlax? Well, we got a secret rare one coming out. Another rare, yo! 
the best chefs ever made. Beyonce. All right, well, rip. All right, anyways, I'll wrap the video, guys, on the single strike mustard deck. Um, it's fun to play, not gonna lie. It is kind of fun to put some stuff in play. I'm glad we got to use Embor. Um, yeah, pretty cool deck. Uh, after playing it, I definitely maybe want to play more supporters, maybe play a Palpat or two, uh, maybe play an Eldegoss. But it's just, again, you don't have a lot of bench space in this deck. That's like my main issue is the bench space is kind of tight with this deck. So it's a little tough to say. Maybe cut one rod. I, I found two rods might have been overkill. Maybe just one rod was better. Um, but overall, yeah, pretty cool deck. Uh, definitely mustard will get a lot better. And if you guys want to see me do rapid strike mustard, let me know by leaving a like and dropping a comment down below saying you want to see it. As always, guys, check out Scar Cabin down below. Use code LDF, uh, sub to the channel. If you're new to the channel, help me on the road to reaching 17 thousand subscribers uh yeah and make sure to follow my twitch because on friday i will be opening up a chilling arena booster box so check that out and i'll be giving away some codes too on the stream so yeah thanks for watching i'll see you guys on another peace show video peace out